Beyonce. Do you mm-hmm. do you watch the basketball wives? I mean, you know I do, boo. You know I do. Girl, I'm gonna need you to comment on Miss Tammy and to Miss Mika getting into it, cause honey, that's what everybody been talking about it. And you know, I need to, I need you to do an official. Well, you know what? I'm gonna keep it real. <laughs> I'm gonna keep it real. Dot <clears throat> com. Ever since basketball wives have started back this season, they have got this new member, which is Mika. Mm-hmm. You know, and I love Tammy because she's keeping real, you know. She's like, you know, form your own opinion about these girls, you know. Don't just go off of what somebody tells you. So Mika came in. She did not form her own opinion. She went off of what other people were telling her. Right. You know, and so that's when Tammy starts not liking her. And one thing about Mika is she talks too much. Hmm. She don't know how to, you know, shut up, and then she lies, too. Like, if she says something about you, she's the type of person that can't come to you and tell you what you have, what she has to say. Right. So that's why I've been beef with her and Tammy all the time, because she was talking about Tammy, but she would never come and tell Tammy. It was always somebody else coming back and telling Tammy what she said, which it should have been her. So she get mad at, um, let me get her name right. She get mad at, um... What the hell is her name? See, this is, you know, she's not really that important either. But she got, let's just say, oh, girl, she got mad at her because she talked too much too. Uh, her name is Susie. Susie. She told Susie stuff about Tammy. So, you know, Susie, by her not being that cool with you, of course she's going to go back and tell Tammy since she knows Tammy like that. Why wouldn't she? You know, if that's my yeah. goal, get a bitch, I'm going to go back and tell her. You know what I mean? And... Mm-hmm. She went back and told T- um, Tammy what Mika said. So, you know, and, you know, and Tammy just started going off. And she was like, I thought we had settled this, you know, where we were going to be cool, you know, and where you weren't going to be talking stuff behind anybody's back anymore. So, you know, they got to the little, you know, club or whatever they were going to. So, you know, Tammy actually brought it up. And she was like, you know, so what's this that she told, you know, someone so and so, you know, of course, you can tell somebody lying or beating around the bush. She's, you know, Tammy, like, keep it real, you know. So Tammy just got really tired. I don't think it had anything to do with Mika pouring her finger because, you know, Tammy has a thing with you putting your fingers up in her face and stuff. So she just punched her. I probably went too fast for y'all, but I'm sorry. <laughs> I seen the clip online. I was like, she she got, you know, talking about, girl, what you say? I can't hear you. Why are you talking? Baby, she was, I'm like, ooh. I love Tammy because she's keeping real, you know. And it's, it's like, why you come on and you didn't, you know, form your own opinions about these girls? You just went off of what somebody else tell you. Right. You know, you didn't like Royce because so-and-so didn't like Royce. You know, that ain't got nothing to do with you. Just because so-and-so don't like them don't mean you won't like them. Right, right. People do that, too. People tend to do that. I hate people that don't form their own opinions when they meet somebody. Why are you going off somebody else's vibe? Just because they don't get along with, don't know with them don't mean you had, won't. Like, what kind of vendetta they had against that person? And, they, and why they trying to get you? Like, I need to, like, yeah, you know. Mm-hmm. And so she gets mad at Susie because she like, Susie, why are you going to tell her what I said? And I'm thinking, like, you must be really stupid if you think she wasn't going to go tell um, Tammy what you said. And when y'all ain't even that cool, why wouldn't she tell Tammy what you said if y'all ain't cool like that? Tell me. But you know, she probably won't be in a circle that long. She probably won't be in a circle that long because she talks too much. Right. She talks too much. Honey, these hoes need to have a seat, honestly. They really do. Hey, I, I enjoy the excitement. Oh, trust me. You know, the thing about that is, the thing about that is, you know how some people call themselves professional, you know, I carry myself like this, you know, I'm a business, you know, and all that. But how do you get on the show when you just as ghetto as hell? You got all this money, but you as ghetto as hell. I was making and you talking about, girl. Right, and you talking about at the end of the day, I'm professional, I got kids, y'all got this. But when I watch you on the show, it doesn't seem like you're professional. Mm-hmm. Girl, 
You know, you talk about all that, but it doesn't. It don't seem that way from me looking. I don't know about anybody else, but what I'm taking from it don't seem like you're professional at all. Mm-hmm. But that's, that's me, you know. Funny. Maybe other people might think professional, but I, I didn't take it as that. Yeah. Oh. Mm. Yeah. I should go with honey. Y'all need to really get into it, and y'all need to watch this show. Cause I'm a it's watching. hot, trust I'm me. It is. Yes, you need to get in there, cause I, you know, I, you know, I just, I don't know, I just, I just really not into a lot of the reality shows. But I'm gonna start getting online, and watching them. Cause I ain't got no shit, I ain't got no cable here, so I'm gonna start watching. You go, Sally. I'm gonna start doing some reviews on. We gonna start doing reviews on that. Cause that's yeah, you know, I'll like. make sure I'm writing down what's going on. But we'll okay. we'll stay tuned. You're gonna be our official person that do the reviews on the reality show, girl. Cause you, yeah, you know, I'm gonna stay tuned in. Because <laughs> you know, we didn't get to talk. We didn't get to talk too much about the black. Supposed to be starting back up um, season seven. I don't. I don't. I think that's already been started. If I'm not mistaken, oh, more than sure it already has. I don't know. I ain't tuned in for that. You know, I'm I'm over once the first and once the other season was going. I'm kind of over Bad Girls Club, to be quite honest. It's not like it used to be. It's like these bitches come on. Thing now. Like, it, it's it like they really come. It's like they really come on just to just to do that, just to be on TV. Like, yeah. Yeah, I mean, it, it's almost like American Idol. Like I'm, I'm over American Idol. I've been over American Idol about three, four seasons now. Like seriously, like okay, y'all done. I don't know. Just I, just, I think it's such thing as overkill when it comes to some of these shows. Mhm. It, it was, it, it was still popping at one point, but when you start seeing the same old people win, you know, I'm going with that. Then I'm like. Wait a minute, something about this show seems kind of weird. It ain't got shit to do with no no American vote. Don't even go there. Don't even give me that BS. Oh, this is 100% the American's choice. Oh, sure it is. Whatever. What is it, 40%? Mm-hmm. You know me, I, shoot, I got nothing to say about that. That's ridiculous. Because you damn sure ain't going to put nobody up there that can't hear the note. And have them win. So don't even go there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm ready for X Factor. You know that's ready for Which one? It's called X Factor. X Factor. It's, yeah. it, it's over there. I think it's a Britain show. If I'm not, what, is that one? I think something like that. Oh yeah, it, that's the one where uh, Simon is on there. Yeah. On there. Mm-hmm. He's yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. You know Simon, he gonna keep it real. He gonna he ain't gonna keep he gonna keep it real. <laughs> <You see him? laughs> yes, he is. He, he is a hot mess. Yeah, he is crazy. But yeah, I'm definitely gonna stay tuned into the hot shows. Just yeah, we gonna, well, you know, whenever you wanna do some reviews, you need to let me know. Cause you know, I, I, I'm, Cause you know, I'm, my girl Lala got her show getting ready to come on. Well, my be days, well, you know, I'm like, I'm want to tune in to that show because it's supposed to be hot. So, we'll see I what like happens. And then, you know, Lorianne Gibson, I don't know if you know her, but she's like a dance choreographer. She has a show coming on BET, on the, I think, right. in August as well. I'm not sure if it's on the same day or not, but, yeah. She has a show, too. I bet you know how that goes, too. <laughs> I think that's, yeah. That, yeah, that will get the girls coming if we start doing them reviews, honey. Yeah. The reality TV is where it's at right now. <clears throat> you know. Oh, it's another show that we have. To, it's another show that we need to talk about, too. It's called Single Ladies. This show is hot. Oh, really? it's hot. Yes. It is hot. It has um, Lisa Ray McCoy. It has um, Stacey. Stacey Dash, and what's, I don't know Does the other girl's name. Does she have her own reality show, Lisa Ray? Yeah, the real McCoy that comes on, on um, what's the name, yeah. TV One, but it, it, it's off the air now. Yeah, she just, did her, she just did her second season, and it just went off not too long ago. Uh, okay. So you said yeah, single yeah. ladies. Yes, yeah, so it come on VH1 right after uh, Basketball Wise. It's hot, trust me. 
It's a hot show. You will definitely be tuned in. It's a hot show. <laughs> I love it because I'm thinking they single and they doing the dang thing. You know how. All right, get that paper and get that, get the, yeah, get that. Right? Mm-hmm. And really, to be quite honest, none of them are really asking a man for nothing, though. I mean, some of them right. do date men that, you know, got money or right. But a lot right. of them don't even have to do that because they work. You know, yeah. I'm on her own business. So, you know, if I'm so right. <laughs> And just date a lot of ball and start callers, you know. <laughs> mm-hmm. 